Hey basketball fans, welcome back to our channel, where we celebrate the legends of the game and the incredible stories behind them. Today, we're diving into the extraordinary career of the one and only Michael Jordan. Whether you're a longtime fan or new to basketball, Jordan's legacy is something that resonates with everyone. His incredible moments on the court have become legendary, inspiring countless players and fans around the world. Before we jump into today's video, if you love our content and want to see more, make sure to smash that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. Your support means the world to us. Now, let's get into it. These are the 11 times Michael Jordan went very far. Number 11, the flu game. One of the most iconic moments of Jordan's career was during game five of the 1997 NBA Finals against the Utah Jazz. Despite being visibly ill and weakened by what was believed to be the flu, although later rumored to be food poisoning. Jordan played 44 minutes and scored 38 points, including a crucial three-pointer in the final seconds to secure the team's victory. This game exemplifies Jordan's ability to overcome adversity and perform at the highest level. While most of us would stay in bed with a fever, Jordan battled on the court, leading his team to victory with sheer determination and incredible skill. This performance remains one of the most inspiring moments in sports history. Number 10, the Corey Benjamin Challenge. In 1999, Corey Benjamin, a young player for the Chicago Bulls, declared that he could beat Michael Jordan one-on-one. -on -one. Despite being retired, Jordan accepted the challenge and visited a Bulls training session. Facing Benjamin, Jordan showcased his undying competitiveness and skill easily dominating the young player. This episode is a reminder that even off the court, Jordan's legacy and prowess are undeniable. Anyone who challenges Jordan must be prepared to face the legend at full force. Number nine, the 55 point game on his return. After his first retirement, Jordan returned to the NBA in March, 1995 Less than two weeks later, he scored 55 points against the New York Knicks at Madison Square Garden, reminding everyone why he was considered the best. This game, known as Double Nickel, was the powerful statement that Jordan still had what it took to dominate the league. His ability to score at will and lead his team on one of basketball's biggest stages was a clear message. Jordan was back and he was ready to reclaim his throne. The performance included a variety of mid-range shots, drives, and an outstanding final play where he assisted Bill Wennington for the winning basket. Number eight, the jump over Dikembe Mutombo. In the 1996 to 1997 season, Jordan had a particular duel with Dikembe Mutombo, one of the best defenders in the league. After some playful provocation from Mutombo, Jordan promised to dunk on him. In a later game against the Atlanta Hawks, Jordan made good on his promise, performing a spectacular dunk on Mutombo, and then mimicking Mutombo's signature finger-wagging gesture. This play showcased Jordan's skill, confidence, and his competitive spirit to respond to challenges. Number seven, the title shot against the Jazz. In game six of the 1998 NBA Finals, the Bulls were down by one point against the Utah Jazz with just seconds left. Jordan stole the ball from Karl Malone and then scored a jump shot over Brian Russell to secure the Bulls' sixth championship. This shot is not only a highlight of Jordan's career, but also one of the most iconic moments in basketball history. It epitomized Jordan's clutch performance and his ability to deliver when it mattered the most. Number six, the double clutch game against the Lakers. In game two of the 1991 NBA Finals against the Los Angeles Lakers, Jordan made a career-defining play. Driving to the basket, he rose for a right-handed layup, then shifted the ball to his left hand in midair to avoid Sam Perkins and scored. This play highlighted Jordan's incredible creativity and skill in the air, becoming a signature moment of his first championship run. Number five, the leap over Patrick Ewing. In the 1991 playoffs during a series against the New York Knicks, Jordan executed one of the most spectacular plays of his career. After a reverse fake, Jordan rose and made a powerful dunk, jumping over Patrick Ewing, one of the league's best defenders. This play showcased Jordan's explosive athleticism 
and his ability to dominate even the toughest opponents. Number 4. The jump from the free throw line, known as the 1988 Slam Dunk Contest. One of the most iconic moments in Jordan's career was his participation in the 1988 Slam Dunk Contest. Jordan performed a dunk from the free throw line, a feat that catapulted him into legend. This dunk, executed with incredible grace and power, has become one of the most iconic images in NBA history. It earned him the championship of that year's contest and solidified his status as one of the greatest dunkers of all time. Number 3. The Shot Over Charles Barkley and 55 Points In Game 4 of the 1993 NBA Finals against the Phoenix Suns, Jordan scored a crucial shot over Charles Barkley in the final seconds to secure the Bulls' victory. Barkley, the MVP of that season, was unable to stop Jordan, who finished with 55 points in that game, one of his best performances in the finals. This shot was the key moment that helped the Bulls secure their third consecutive championship. Number 2. The 63-point game against the Celtics During the second game of the first round of the 1986 playoffs against the Boston Celtics, Jordan scored 63 points, setting the record for most points in a playoff game. Although the Bulls lost in double overtime, Jordan's performance was so impressive that Larry Bird commented that he had been God disguised as Michael Jordan. This game solidified Jordan as an unstoppable force even in his early years in the NBA. Number 1. The 69-point game against the Cavaliers On March 28, 1990, Michael Jordan delivered one of the most amazing performances of his career in a game against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Jordan scored 69 points, the most he ever recorded in a single game throughout his career. The magnitude of his performance was even more impressive, considering the Bulls were facing a Cavaliers team with serious playoff aspirations. Not only did Jordan dazzle with his scoring ability, but he also dominated in other areas of the game, finishing with 18 rebounds, 6 assists, and 4 steals. His ability to penetrate the defense and finish with a variety of shots and dunks left the Cavaliers' defenders helpless. Jordan's capacity to elevate his team's performance in critical moments was evident in every possession. Michael Jordan not only redefined what it meant to be a basketball player, but he also set a standard of excellence and competitiveness that remains the benchmark for players today. These 11 moments when Jordan went too far are a testament to his incredible skill, unwavering determination, and ability to shine in the most crucial moments. His legacy in the NBA is a testament to his greatness and how a player can transcend the sport and become a living legend. We want to hear from you. What plays did you know, and which ones surprised you? Do you think there will ever be another player with the ability to do what Jordan did? Share your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. Remember, our channel is about celebrating the legends of the game and the incredible stories behind them. Stay tuned for more great content. And, as always, keep the passion for sports alive. See you in the next video.